Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So, bit of a different setup today. I just did the woe. Anyway, um, yeah, I just thought today I would do a Zara haul. I wanted to do one of these a couple of weeks ago um, and then I realised that they had like a sale coming up. So I just waited till the sale. Um, even though the majority of the things I got are from the sale. But, nevertheless... Um, I'm gonna get straight into it because I usually do like like five minute long intro and it's just not needed um, but if you haven't already then please do subscribe down below um, I current well I'm currently hoping to upload twice a week um, and if you haven't already then please follow me on Instagram I will leave my name somewhere on the screen let's just get into the Zara haul Okay, so I may as well start with the two things that I'm currently already wearing. Well, three things, actually. First being this top. Um, it is just a really super simple, plain, it's like a stone-coloured top. By the way, can we just ignore how not tanned I am? Um, I understand, I know, but let's just move past it. Okay, so then, yeah, it's just kind of this, that classic, like, Zara like neckline this is the kind of shape that the bodysuits all are in Zara you know the ones that like everyone has um and yeah it's just it's kind of a longer crop I do have a very long body and this still comes down really quite far on me which is nice um usually I order crop tops and they're literally like little bras on me um but yeah I really like it the back is pretty much exactly the same as the front um, you don't need a bra with this, it's really thick, it's not see-through at all, and they, th I think they had this in white and black. Um, I usually would have ordered all three colours, I'm not going to lie, because I knew that I liked this style of top. Um, but I'm pretty sure that the white was out of stock in all sizes, I'm not sure. I will link everything down below anyway, just in case, but I'm pretty sure they, that was out of stock. It might be back in stock now. Um, and then... I did get a pair of mum jeans from Zara. Now, I'm just gonna have to move the camera back a little bit. Okay, so the annoying thing is is that I can't show you a full length because I can't put the camera back far enough and you still be able to hear me. But they're just the classic Zara mum jeans. Um, by the way, if you're gonna order these jeans, I personally would say size up. Um, I got these in a 10 and they were still a big struggle to get on for the first time. This is the second time trying them on because I've already tried everything on. And they were a lot easier to get on today. But I have been on a diet for two days. So who knows why, but definitely size up. Um, but other than that, they fit lovely. I am very tall. Well, apparently I'm tall. I don't think I'm that tall. I'm like 5'8". Well, five seven and a half. So pretty much five eight. And they kind of hit like just above my ankle bones. If you can see that. <laughs> um but yeah, they fit really, really nicely. And I've got not really much more to say about them. I love Zara jeans, but I've never had um the mom jeans. And I got these in the light blue. I think they have like light blue, dark blue, mid blue, but these are the light wash ones. Um, but yeah, they fit really nicely. They do flatten your bum a little bit, but I don't really care about that, so I'm not too bothered. And then, last kind of out of this outfit are these earrings. They're really, really cute. These were definitely in the sale. I know these were in the sale. Um, couldn't tell you how much they were, but... They've got little lemons on. I did think these were going to be a lot smaller um, when I ordered them online. But they're not. Um, which is fine. I don't really care. They're just really cute. They also had a matching necklace. But I have so much jewellery. And I literally wear the same like pieces of jewellery all the time. So it wasn't really much point in me buying that. The next thing I picked up is this gorgeous blue satin shirt. Um, I saw this on Sydney May Crouch, you know, Sid and Al, her Instagram page, and I literally just had to buy it. This is pretty much the whole reason why I went on Zara in the first place. Um, it's just gorgeous. It's just this beautiful, like, um, I don't even know how, what colour blue I would describe this as. It's, it's kind of more of a muted blue. It's not like a bright blue or 
anything um but yeah i think this is gorgeous i have just popped it on over that first stone color top i wouldn't wear this underneath um but i would wear this shirt open um i wouldn't i don't think i would do it up it's a bit um like too like old woman-y i think if you do it up um but nevertheless i think this is stunning and i think it's really nice um in the summer to have things like this or like little shirts and you can just wear them as almost like a jacket i know this is thin but you could wear this as more of a jacket with just some jeans and um a cute little top underneath but yeah i think it is a beautiful and by the way if you want to see um how sydney looks in this because she looks a lot better in it than me then i'll leave her instagram link down below as well um and her Instagram is absolutely gorgeous at the minute, so definitely check her out. But yeah, I love this shirt. And I can't wait to actually have somewhere to wear it that isn't my home. Or at least my bedroom, because I live at home. Okay, so next item I picked up is actually this really super cute Little Mermaid t-shirt. Um, I just thought that this was just really cute. I just could not get it. And then flounders on the back, if you can see that. Um, yeah, if anyone knows me, they know that I love Disney. Um, I went to Disneyland in Paris twice in the space of three months. So I am a little bit Disney obsessed. Um, however, I still think this t-shirt is really, really cute, even if you're not like a Disney fan like me. I mean, I don't know why you would buy it if you didn't like Disney, but... Um, yeah, and what I really like about the material of this top is like, I don't know if you'll be able to see if I come up any closer. Um, ooh, there we go. It's like almost like a knitted cotton. It's a little bit thicker than a normal t-shirt. Um, and it's super soft. Um, yeah, and obviously the prints are in lilac. Um, I'm not sure if you can tell by my rail. But lilac is kind of my favourite colour at the minute. Um, fun fact actually, the leotard I wore for all of my, um, dance college auditions, well, universities, was lilac. So, maybe it's just my lucky colour, I don't know. But yeah, I love this t-shirt, there's really not that much to say. I did get this in a size large. Um, it is oversized, but it's not that long. Again, I am long. I know, I feel like I really do need to emphasise this that my actual like torso like my actual body is long my legs are really not that long in comparison to the rest of me um all of my height pretty much comes from my like midsection so even if this t-shirt is meant to be long it probably wouldn't be long on me is what i'm trying to say so if you are any shorter than me or if you just have a normal body shape then this will probably fit you just like a normal oversized t-shirt it's just super cute and i would literally wear this with anything like i would go out with like i can't speak i would go out in the, like this t-shirt and jeans and trainers if i was just, like going on a chill if like a coffee date or like just meeting up with a friend or whatever um or i would literally wear this with joggers um and just to chill in around the house like it's just a versatile piece you know and i'll definitely be taking it on my next disney trip which hopefully will be soon okay, so i've popped you a bit further back just so i could show you these um cute little shorts i picked up i also did pick up this classic zara bodysuit i do already own this so i'm not going to keep it however my version of this is in my london home so i don't actually have it hence i had to order it for this video um, really sorry if this light is making anything a little bit see-through. I can't tell from all the way back here. But, yes, I picked up these little shorts. Um, I'm not sure how well you can see. Sorry, I know it's really annoying, but I do have stairs in my room. So, yeah, I picked up these little lilac shorts. They're like a really flowy, just really loose, comfy material. They've got a lovely little swing to them. Um, I did pick these up in a medium. Now, I don't know whether it's just me that thinks this, but I do think that sometimes Zara's sizing can be a little bit hit or miss. Um, like, I could order something in a small and it will be, like, the perfect size. Or I could order something 
and a small and it'd be like super tiny and have to get a large in that in that thing if you know what I mean like you just have to kind of go with what you think is gonna fit so I did pick up these shorts in a medium they are they are too big like I could have wore I could have gotten a small um, but they're not too big in which they're gonna fall down like they're not big enough for me to warrant sending them back to order a small if that makes sense um, but I do think they're really really lovely again I really don't know how well you can see them um, but yeah they are really they're just really nice again I've not got much to say about it um, I have not shopped in Zara properly for months and i think they've got some really really lovely things on their website i really recommend just going on zara oh i thought they had pockets then but they don't it's just a pleat um do, they do have pockets <gasps> oh i love them even more now anything with a pocket is always better so yeah these are really lovely and they weren't too expensive i don't think i shall check for you they were 20 pounds 19.99 they did have a matching like button up kind of blousey shape type thing that went with these. I just wasn't a fan. I wouldn't have worn the outfit as a whole. So I just picked the shorts up. Ta-da! But yeah, really cute. Okay, so next we have this beautiful skirt. Like this is absolutely gorgeous. I know you can't see it that well. I will tilt you down in a sec. Um, it's kind of like an off white it's not cream and it's not as white as this which may which may be why they look slightly different um oh my gosh i just think this is gorgeous i went on the website about a week and a half ago and this skirt was out of stock in a small and a medium and then when i went back on to shop the sale um it was back in stock and i can't remember if this one in particular was in the sale um but I just think it's gorgeous. Um, it's super long. I did get this in a size small and it fits perfectly. Um, if I wanted it to be even more fitted, then I could have gotten an extra small. But this is what I mean about Zara sizing. It's just all over the place. Like, this is a small and, like, I could have gotten an extra small. But I'll tilt you down so you can see. Okay, so I really hope you can see this. But yeah, it's got this gorgeous slit in the front so you can have kind of a neo if you're taking pictures and stuff. And oh my gosh, I just think it's really flattering. Like the slit comes up quite far, but because of the way that the kind of ruched um, design, I guess, hangs, like you're never going to be flashing anything, um, which is always lovely. Um, but yeah, I think this would even look really lovely with that kind of stone coloured top I had on in the beginning if you didn't want it to be super dressy. Um, and if I was on holiday, I would literally go out wearing like flip flops with this or you could dress it up with heels. Um, I just think it's gorgeous. I'm pretty sure they did have a matching um, top to this. I don't know if I'm dreaming now, but I'm pretty sure they did. I just think it's gorgeous and it's like, I've got really big calves because um, I am a dancer and I'm usually really funny with skirts that hit kind of a really odd place in my calves but I think because this has a split um, I'm not too mad about it and to be honest I like the skirt that much that I don't even really care if it makes my calves look bigger than they are um, but yeah I just love it I think it's beautiful okay so we've got another kind of skirt type thing however this isn't just skirt this is a skirt. Um, it's this beautiful like lilac-y colour again I'm just obsessed at the minute and it's got this really cute I'll come and try and show you up close you can't see that hang on there you go can you see now it's got this gorgeous like florally print on again I think I got this in a medium I did and I would say if you are going to order these then definitely get a size up um, or order a size up from what you would think because this is a medium and I couldn't have gotten a small. I do love these. My issue is it's just so short. Like, again, I know I'm tall, but and I know this is a skirt, so there are shorts. So it's not like you're wearing a super short skirt. But even that, like, I can literally just feel my bum cheeks just hanging at the back. Like, I don't know if you can see, but, like, that's literally my bum like 
and you can't really pull it down any further because it's meant to go up on your waist um so maybe just bear that in mind again i know i am long but this is you know where they are meant to sit it's really pretty it's just i could i literally would be going out of the house like just covering my bum and just being like really super conscious that everything's hanging out essentially um but they are really really cute i'm, I'm really gutted that they're too that they're too short because i would keep them um but i just i just can't i just can't do it my bum is actually hanging out so but yeah i think they're really cute especially paired with um just a little bodysuit like this and then you could just throw on like a little denim jacket and you'd be good to go with some cute little trainers and it would be really cute it's just really unfortunate that it's just super short okay and then onto the dresses we have this gorgeous yellow dress now i don't know what kind of bra you're gonna wear with this because of the way that it kind of fits but i mean some of you may not need to wear a bra i definitely would need to wear a bra with this dress um but i just loved how this fit i loved this gorgeous neckline um i love the color it's quite a bright lemon um but this is literally how i pictured wearing it so like my hair screwed back in a bun these cute little earrings in and some heels and this is how i pictured it um the back obviously crisscrosses down the back crisscrosses down the back you know what i mean the straps crisscross down the back and it hits kind of like just above my knee um i will show you but it it literally just flows out um so it's not the most flattering dress i'm gonna be completely honest like this doesn't make me look the smallest like yeah it's just not the most flattering dress but i love the dress so i would wear it anyway i'm not really that bothered about stuff like that um but yeah like i said you would definitely need to wear a bra with this but other than that i think it's gorgeous yeah so this is the dress kind of full length like i said it does pretty much just flow outwards this is definitely a holiday dress i completely get that i would never wear this in the uk i wouldn't even wear this in london um but i just think it's gorgeous and yeah if any of you have a recommendation for like a bra that i could wear with this because yeah i don't know but i really do love this dress so okay and then last but not least well for clothing items anyway is this beautiful lilac dress um again i think i got this in a medium i got the other dress in a medium as well um purely because of my boobage um and this is a complete maxi um i have only ever owned one maxi dress and i think i wore it once on one holiday like a couple of years ago um i'm just not a huge like maxi kind of gal but honestly this dress is so gorgeous i just cannot um i think it is beautiful so yeah i mean you can see the color um it's this beautiful like really kind of almost like a rich lilac obviously i know i'm super pale at the minute um and i would be obviously like self tanned like wearing this out of the house um but it's gorgeous it feels really expensive actually like it doesn't feel like this costs 20 pounds um because i think that's how much it is um i'm not sure but I, it's just absolutely beautiful like so yeah obviously i can't go down i can't go down i can't go back any further than this but you can kind of see if i go on my tippy toes like oh, try not to trip over my rail um you can see it's super long and again there is no like form fitting kind of style to this it is just a complete straight up and down dress um i'd even go as far to say it flows more outwards um so maybe if you were a little bit insecure of like a tummy area or your hip area then this dress would be really good for you because it will just skim kind of over all of that for you um it has kind of um a seam down the front which as you can see causes like folds in the like if i'm looking in the viewfinder now that to me looks like almost like a jumpsuit um which is nice but it's so 
just flowy and it just feels like honestly just feels like a little princess dress it's got such a nice swing to it as well so like if you were like walking on holiday you know when your wedges your little bag and your suntan yeah i think it's beautiful that's about all i'm gonna say because i think this is my favorite thing from the whole haul so okay and then last but by no means least i did pick up a swimsuit um i'm not going to try it on because it doesn't fit um essentially i ordered this gorgeous um bather it's like that crinkly but there we go it's that like crinkly material and it does come with little pads in which i always take out but they're there if you want them um again like this is lovely i've got nothing bad to say about it at all it's just my body is too long so i kind of like the like the neck is super low and then the leg area comes up literally like to my waist um my body just like pulls it a little bit too much um but that's just because of my body shape so if you do have like a little bit of a shorter body than me which i'm pretty sure that every human on the planet does then yeah this would be lovely they had this in white and in lilac originally it was in my basket in lilac and then i realized that the majority of the things i bought were lilac so i thought i would order it in this like sagey green kind of color and it's really really nice it just unfortunately it doesn't fit but i really like this color there are a few things that i'm really bright now wow it's this gorgeous swimsuit and what was I even saying? Oh yeah, they um, had quite a lot of things this colour on the website. Um, they had a few bodysuits in this colour, um, a few tops in this colour. This is quite an in colour at the minute though, isn't it? Like this kind of sagey green is um, having a bit of a moment. Um, but yeah, really lovely, but it just doesn't fit. Okay, so that is everything that I picked up from Zara. Um, I really hope you enjoyed um yeah i literally love everything i got like obviously some things don't fit me quite right but i still love the items so i think it has been very successful so please let me know down below what your favorite item was um and give this a thumbs up if you want to continue to see um more hauls i've got a few ideas but you know who knows and like I said at the beginning, if you haven't already or if you are new, then please do subscribe because I would love you to. And like I said also at the beginning, if you aren't already, then please follow me on Instagram. And I hope you're all having a lovely, lovely week. And I will see you, what day is it? Friday. I will see you probably on Sunday or Monday with a video with my mum when she actually decides she's ready to sit down and do it with me. So yeah, that's everything because I, like I always make my intros very long, I make my outros very long as well. So I'm gonna say goodbye now. So <laughs> I'll see you all in a few days. Bye everyone.